A law lecturer at uh, Gimpa Law School, George Bafo Asari Efri, has made a strong case for a uh, sort of uh, supranational government within the West Africa sub region to pursue a common agenda for the good of the people. Key amongst the proposal includes the establishment of a common market in a single currency as well as a common central bank for security and economic independence. Speaking at a workshop series, uh, at uh, the Gimpa Law School Thursday, Mr. Sari Free indicated that a supranational government is the surest way that the SAP region could become industrialized and co compete with the likes of the European Union. There's more in this report. The court should also have the power to issue binding judgments and orders that the Commission or other mechanisms can enforce. Three, developing a common market and a monetary union for the region by harmonizing trade mr sarefriye was speaking at a workshop dubbed giving ECOWAS a teeth a case a of supranational market. government for the west african sub region now be back he called on contemporary market. african leaders and to commit to the cause of a sub regional spend. government by ceding off part of their into. sovereignty <laughs> for the realization <laughs> of a supranational but government now. various governments have to cede some of their sovereignty to this body this is because I'm of the opinion that ECOWAS does not have the teeth to bite. So regarding most of these policies, they are not able to implement. Beyond the potential economic benefits, Mr. Asarefriye believes security architecture of member countries will be strengthened if they are successful at implementing a sub-regional government. Fostering a common foreign and security policy for the region coordinating diplomatic actions, positions, and representations among member states on sub-regional and international issues, and establishing a common defense and security mechanisms that can respond to threats and threats as well, and challenges to peace and stability in the sub-region. He says the countries might as well scrap existing blocks if they are unwilling to pursue a sub-regional government. And we do not get rid of this by having this supranational organization or supranational government to see to the enforcement of the various policies that we have, the various protocols, the various treaties that we have, then it's better we just scrap ECOWAS. The next step for Mr. Sarefriye is to make copies of the presentation available to the ECOWAS Commission and other relevant organizations.